Today's project is a diamond point. It's orange, but most such big orange pens are actually celluloid. This one is hard rubber. You'll often see celluloid pens misidentified as hard rubber. This one is the real thing. You can tell by the chasing. Chasing is very unusual in a celluloid pen in general. Um, you can also, with experience, you get feel for the weight and uh, hard rubber being considerably heavier and more opaque. Uh, the other thing to take note of too here, I'm going to take a little bit of cloth that's been moistened and has a little bit of um, polish on it and you rub the surface and you see the color comes right off. This will not happen. You'll get a little dirt coming off of an orange celluloid pen but uh, this is a dead giveaway for red hard rubber in a simple test. So here we go to the heat gun. Uh, we're going to need it to open up any hard rubber pen. Uh, red hard rubber is so fragile. This material, uh, it's hard to convey. It's Sometimes it's likened to glass. I like to think of it as being more like terracotta. It has about as much softness and flexibility. But once you heat it up, let me turn on the heat gun here. Once heated up, it restores the rubberiness, the plasticity, and it becomes nice and soft. So gauge the heat with the hand. Hot to the touch, hot to the touch, and then at this point, it opens right up and you have the old sack and you're ready to remove. Heat is also useful for removing an old sack. It softens the shellac, also softens any hardened hard rubber. There we go. Give this a quick run, nice and clean. Heat is also necessary on reassembly. So we have the new sack in, and we don't want to force it in. That's This is one of the main areas where you get breakage. Warm up, that's nice and soft now. Can feel it. Oh, and that eases in there. Straighten it out, and we're good to go.